But before we get deeper into the video, I want to show you guys today's sponsor. Why wait to see what your future holds when you can put fate into your own hands? Divine your destiny with Shadowverse's 17th card set, Fortune's Hand. This set has 97 initial cards with new cards coming in August. A new mechanic, Rally, has been introduced with this card set. Cards with Rally activate when the number of allied followers that follow you into a match are equal to or greater than the Rally value. Followers with a fanfare Rally effect will not count towards their own Rally count. Shadowverse has amazing features such as battling real-time opponents from around the world or enjoying fully voiced story mode. Stargaze with innovative mechanics that guarantee insane battles. You can also master eight different character classes with completely different skills, unique abilities, and killer cards. On top of that, you can summon 1500 plus cards, each lavishly illustrated with jaw-dropping fantasy art. Personally, I'm really enjoying the gameplay. I've been playing it a ton and I would highly recommend that you guys do it too. I'm going to put a link in my description that you guys can click. It really, really does help me and I would really appreciate it. If you guys can give the game a try, trust me, it is super fun and I would highly recommend. So go ahead, click that link in the description and let's get playing. Yo! What's going on guys, Bobby here, and today we're back with another video. So today we have kind of an almost rank 35 gameplay video. Now, as you guys know, Colt is not one of the better brawlers in the meta right now, especially after Surge came into meta and you face Surge basically every single map, every single mode. It's just a complete hard counter for Colt and has been a very tough push. So a lot of brawlers, or a lot of players I should say, have decided not to push Colt just for now until Surge gets a nerf, but I decided, you know, why not take on that challenge? And I'm not really the best Colt myself, but I have been learning a lot on this push and I definitely have gotten better. So if I do take you guys to the, to the Colt leaderboards over here, you guys are going to see that we're actually really high up on second place and third place, etc. And we're doing really, really well. We probably will have a rank 35 video coming for you guys soon. But as of now, we are only at 1211. Now, I did want to get a video out for you guys. So I'm not going to wait until rank 35. I'm going to do a video right now and then potentially again a rank 35 video. But with that being said, again, I've been super busy with practicing for the finals that are going to be on this Sunday um, at 12, uh, 12 Eastern at noon. So again, you guys know I like to do daily videos, but unfortunately because of that, it's a really big priority. We have to win that. So we're going to be trying our best. We've been practicing all day. We will be back to daily videos soon. But with that being said, let's hop into the games and let's get it started. So we're going to start off with a pretty funny game over here. So what we're going to be doing is going up against Bull, Bull and Primo. So a very tanky comp, something that I actually love to face because, you know, Colt just absolutely shreds tanks. You guys can see I'm going up against Primo here. I was left alone defending, which kind of sucks, but I was able to hit some really, really good clips on defense. We did only 32 percent though while they did 53 while i defended as well as possible so unfortunately not the greatest start but we do have some really good possession over here kano is going to get a really good super off i'm going to get another juicy super that's getting me a lot of value because i'm hitting safe and primo at the same time and you guys can see we're just taking out safe super fast and we're going to be able to win this kind of hard counter to kano really really quickly i know that was a quick game but that was kind of a fun one so again let's hop into the next game and let's get things going. So here we go into our next game. We're going up against Gale, Brock, and uh, and a Bull. So Brock is really meta here, as well as Gale. We face Gale almost every single game, so it's pretty tough. We have a Gale for defense and obviously for that launch pad. I'm kind of just chilling in the mid, and then we have Kano for offense. We try as hard as we can to get myself on offense, but we have to take care of defense and mid control before I can do that. But as you guys can, as you guys obviously know, Gale's a really good brawler. It's really good on defense here. As you guys can see, this Gale is kind of just lurking in the bushes. I almost take it out, but unfortunately it survives with 280 HP. Now our Gale is just lurking in our grass, you know, figuring stuff out. I'm pretty sure their Gale wants them to move the jump pad forward so that the bull can go over. Bull charges in. I have really high DPS, as you guys know, so I'm going to be defending that. We defend it pretty easily, but we haven't done that much damage. Only 19%, and the round kind of just started. Or not the round, sorry. The game kind of just started, and they already have 32. So it's not looking quite good for us right now. Um, luckily, you know, they're not doing too, too much as well, so things are going pretty well. I do go down over there, and this is a pretty tough spot because Brock and Bull, Bull both do a lot of damage. But our Gale is doing a very good job at defending. Now, we are down by about 27% right now, so things aren't looking great. Kano goes down again, but we're able to handle defense pretty well, the, you know, considering the circumstances. Plus, we're able to kill their Gale, which allows me to now go up and start to do some damage. So once we get the Colt on safe, things start looking really, really good for obvious reasons. The DPS is really high. The bull jumps on our safe, but myself and Kano are kind of just shredding their safe at the moment. I'm just staying up doing as much damage as possible. We're able to do a lot of damage. We have Kano left on the safe. He's going to be able to hit one shot, two, and he's going to be able to get that last one. No, he's not actually, so... Their Gale, or our Gale now, is going to go for the jump. 
We're going to defend on this bull over here, but we're going to be able to get it. This one was a very close game, only won by 10%, but again, a W, so top into the next game, and again, let's keep going. Now, hopping into the next game, this one was actually quite the challenge as we're going against Daryl, Spike, and Mr. P. So this is a pretty hard comp for us to beat because Mr. P is really annoying for all of us. None of us really do well against Mr. P. So I'm taking some shots there. Mr. P is going to be mid. Luckily, though, they don't have a uh, they don't have a Gale, which is kind of the meta here, as I've said already. So that's kind of a good thing for us. I'm able to take out their Daryl pretty easily. I'm trying to line up uh, super so I can hit the Penguin. I call Mr. P the Penguin and the and the safe to try and get, you know, really good value. Unfortunately, I can't, but I'm getting some good kills over here and some good damage. So that's really good, obviously. Getting another super on safe. The spike is going to be on us now, but we're going to be able to dodge the RNGs that it's shooting at us. So we are going to be able to stay up. I'm getting some really good clips over here on that spike. I'm able to stay alive barely but i'm able to do so so you know pretty good 56 health right now Kano's probably going to jump in he's going to um spike's going to stay on that wall there we're going to be able to get a kill i'm going to full clip that mr p over there there is a daryl that has roll and so unfortunately that daryl is going to take out our gale but so far so good hitting some pretty good clips over there um the spike is one shot i have my super now so i'm trying to take it a little bit slowly instead of going through the middle i'm deciding to go through that right side Kano's going to be able to get a kill, and me and Kano on safe is just a ton of damage, so we're going to be able to win that game right here, and that's going to be it for this one, so again, let's hop into the next game, and let's keep things rolling. So here we go into our next game. Now, again, we're trying to show you guys as many different comps as possible, rather than like triple tank comps or just Gale comps, so this one we're going against 8-Bit, Sandy, and Daryl, so a pretty different comp, actually. Kano's going to mess up jumping on a jump pad. I don't know how you do that, Kano. Literally, all you do is stand still. But he's going to mess it up somehow, but he's going to be able to get a kill and he's going to be on safe. So things are going pretty well. I'm going to just full clip that Daryl, even though it was really low and breaks our grass. I, you know, I'm not really a fan of leaving a Daryl alive and letting it regen. Sandy can't really hurt our safe, so we're just going to be able to leave it over there. Unfortunately, there is a Daryl in our grass that I didn't know of. So he's going to take me out, but Kano did some really good damage. So we're up by a pretty good amount right now. Um, we're just going to be chilling in our spawn, regenning and such. 8-Bit versus Colt is kind of a weird matchup because, you know, both sides have a pro and a con. You know, the 8-Bit is slow and does a lot of damage, but, you know, the fact that it's slow is really good for Colt. The fact that it does a lot of damage is obviously really good for 8-Bit. can take us out easily, so it's kind of a pretty fair matchup. So far, we're kind of getting the best of them right now. Kano is going to be doing some really good damage over there. Only 9% left, and they have to do 84%. So it's looking pretty good for us, I want to say. Um, Connell's going to put that smiley face. Daryl's going to try and roll into us. We're going to be able to get a really easy kill. Me and Kano are going to jump, but then, you know, our Gale tricks us and he jumps instead. He's going to get a few a few shots off, but nothing that they can do because I have super. I'm going to walk up in the mid and just get that anyways. So we're going to be able to get that win. So let's hop into our final two games and show you guys what happened. Now, hopping into this game, this game was very funny as we're facing a Shelly on heist. Like, what are the odds we face a Shelly on heist, especially while running Frank? So Kano's putting up that sad face for obvious reasons over there. Um, they have a Brock, and Brock is really, really good here, especially if you know how to use it. So it's going to be a little bit tough for Kano to do really well here. Um, and it's going to be tough for us to get a win because, again, Kano is our damage, and he just gets absolutely hard countered. So it's a little bit rough. He's going to be checking that grass. He's a little bit afraid of that Shelly, but, you know, as any normal Frank would be, it's very understandable why being afraid of a Shelly. Um, that Shelly is going to try going on Kano. We're going to be able to get that kill, so that's going to open up the middle a little bit, especially because we're able to kill that Gale over there. Kano's going to be able to get a few shots on that safe before Shelly just says, you know, what's up, I'm a Shelly. Um, but we do have a little bit of a lead currently by 11%. I'm going to get a full clip over there on that Shelly, taking it out. Trying to clear some way for Kano to do some damage, but unfortunately, he comes up a little bit late as he was respawning. So it's not going to go very well. He wastes a gadget and a super, and he's going to be taken out over there. So not the greatest showing for Kano, even though, you know, how could you blame him? He is facing a Shelly, so it's pretty even. We're only up 9%, and we're almost halfway through the game right now. Um, Kano's a little bit afraid to jump because he doesn't want to jump into that Shelly. I'm going to be able to get my Colt Super over there, so hopefully I'm able to do something with it. I'm able to hit a couple clips over there. Uh, by clips, I mean a couple shots, which is going to break those walls as well, so that's pretty good. The Shelly is one shot there. They were one shot, so it was kind of looking good for Kano, but unfortunately gets taken out pretty quickly. Um, this is a pretty funny game for Kano, not going to lie. We almost stay alive there, actually, on that double team, but, you know, the Gale's going to survive at one shot. Kano jumps in again. He gets one shot off, two shots, three shots. I don't know what that Shelly was doing, and they're going to be able to get the kill. I'm able to kill that Brock over there. So things are looking really good. Unfortunately, I get Shelly super to the safe, but our Gale is kind of taken down the safe. Um, Shelly misses a super, isn't on defense, and that's probably going to be it because Kano is just going to be able to get those kills over there. 
one more super he's going to be able to get it off and that is going to be it for this game so long at last after two minutes kano was able to do something he's going to somehow get star player but let's hop into our final game and show you guys what it looked like all right, so here we go into our final game. We're going up against Gale, Bull, and Ems, which is a very, very strong comp on this map. If they had a Brock instead of an Ems, it probably would have been like the strongest comp in the game. But they're going to jump forward with the Bull. Very obvious. Um, you know, what else would they do with the Bull? We're able to hit a couple shots. They only do 12% while Kano does 15. So Kano's popping off. I'm just going to start breaking some grass over here because it's a lot easier for me to full clip if I know exactly where they are rather than if I'm just guessing where they are in the grass. We do get this bull to one shot. Um, our, our Gale is able to get that kill. He's doing a really good job. I get my super, so I'm going to start hammering away at the safe. Kano's doing a really good job on the safe as well. Um, things aren't looking too bad for us at the moment. We're up by 30%. I'm able to get a kill on the Gale, but unfortunately, it takes a shot like 0.1 seconds before it dies, and it's going to be able to take me out. Um, our Gale is going to go down. Kano's just going to get outplayed. Nothing he can do. He's stuck in that corner. He's going to get one shot on safe. I'm going to move up, almost able to take out that M's. I'm going to be able to do so at the end, but didn't really play that too great. Kano's stuck on defense, kind of sucks, but he's able to hit that super over there and do some work. I can't super, unfortunately, because Gale has that stun, and he's going to use it on me as soon as I super, so I couldn't do it. But now, fortunately, Kano kind of pops off over here, gets that good stun, breaks some walls, so things are looking pretty good for us. A minute and 15 left in the game, so we're halfway through, and we got that lead. I'm going to get a clip on the bull and the safe, which does some damage, but I am going to go down. Our team is going to double jump. They're going to move forward. Kano uses his super. They're going to go down really quickly, so that wasn't really the greatest play. Their bull is going to jump in, so obviously I have to watch that. We're going to be able to get some kills. I'm going to go for a super on the gale. I'm going to miss a fairly good amount of that, but our gale is able to get a kill over there. Kano is going to jump forward. He uses gadget. I have my shots. I'm going to shoot forward on the safe. Taking some shots, there is a bull in the way, but I'm able to get super, gonna super the safe, and that's going to be it. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this cool gameplay. I know I am no Johnny boy, but maybe one day I'll get there. But anyways, that's gonna be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, you know, obviously, subscribe, hit the like button, comment. But yeah, I'll try and be back tomorrow with that rank 35 Cole. Hopefully I'll see you guys then. Peace.